Yeah, right now he's just sitting on my head. Uh, that that's no, just the picture. I'm, I didn't even finish it. He's sitting okay. close like it. Where's his uh, but, uh, Today on William's Adventures, I have started a little bit late with this video on the game that I'm currently running. I'm gonna turn the camera around so you can see the players and they can introduce themselves. I was gonna do this at the beginning. Except for one of them because he's only temporary here. Everybody else has agreed to this, and so this is a home game, so one of the couples here does have a baby. They're going to have to deal with it. All right, so this is Christina. What are you playing, Christina? Mountain Dwarf. Mountain Dwarf. What, what's your class? Uh, my class is a fighter. What's something special about your character? What's about this? <laughs> your characters are drunk. Yep. <laughs> Got it. Okay. All right, next to her, we have her wonderful husband, Tim. Hello. I'm playing Ivor Oakenheel, a half elf warlock of the cult of daddy issues. And <laughs> right now, with my familiar. Very cranky familiar who is trying to sue. No worries. Like I said, babies. Exactly. Next, we have Ben. What are you playing, Ben? Hello. I am playing a human variant rogue. I took the variant so that I could get a feat, which would be magic initiate, or initiate so that I could have a few extra spells at the beginning, including find familiar. So that I would have my Tressum. It's a half cat, half bird. Mine happens to be an owl-faced cat. He drew this. Alright. At the moment, they've all been arrived in Shadowdale. They're kind of all exploring, headed out to the docks. Because um, the docks have a rat problem. <laughs> The other character that is playing my friend RJ it doesn't want to be on camera, so I'm not going to do that. But I will take and plop the camera down so you can actually start seeing what's going on. All right. So. That's kind of weird. You arrive at the docks. Hmm. As you get ready to say something, I'm going to have to pop Oh, I know, right? So you see boats being unloaded, boats being loaded, grain being moved around. Corn. <laughs> corn. 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 There's a guy up on like a crane moving boxes and crates. And you see a guy basically sitting on a stool with a book directing everything going on. I'll uh, walk up to him and say, excuse me, sir. Sir? Why, yes. Uh, I happened to just come into town, and I went by the message post, and I saw you had a few jobs available that I might be able to uh, work. What are you looking to do? Be hired muscle, help us unload the boats, or take care of our rat problem? Can you tell me about the rat problem? Um, we haven't had a rat problem, or very minimally had rats every now and then. Occasionally we'll find a couple in our warehouse. Not a big deal, wood rats. But the frequency of them has increased and we don't know why. So we need somebody to actually go into our sewer and figure out what's going on. Because uh, we're that we're it's where we're figuring they come from. All right. Uh, do you have any other workers that are working on that problem? Uh, yes, we sent down some people. I don't know what happened to them, but we had some down there. Okay. Um, you said that they come out at night. Yeah. All right. Um. 
Yeah, we don't usually get them on, little, uh, on during the day because all the noise and everything. But at night, like at night, there's been several people bitten uh, trying to recover. May I speak with some of those people? I, I might like to take on this, uh, this rat problem. If it looks like you can do anything. Tim, what's your character's name again? Hold on, I got it right here. I Hold on. Okay, hold on. I got it. I don't think I even have a name. I don't. Nope, you didn't write one down. Um. April. Yeah, we have our... Uh, April. Uh, cleric around here, Ivor, somewhere. He's been dealing with it. Ivor! Ivor, where are you? On hearing my name get called... Come out of the makeshift medical hut they provided for me, uh, and come up to the dock master. Has there been another biting? No, this guy wants to talk to you about our rat problem. You've been dealing with it. Oh yes, the the rat problem. Yes, four bites just today. Christina, you come walking up about this time. Oh God, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh, so foozy. <laughs> B.O. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? I have rats. The, uh, the Tressum just like what? lays over. Yeah. Sticks his feet in the windows. Your eyes still messed up? Yes. Okay. I, 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 I hear okay. rats. I'm here for the job of another rat problem. Oh, good. It's all on timing. He was about to explain to him. Yes. This is Ivor. He's our resident cleric. Ivor Oakenheel. Question. He said cleric. Does this breathe cleric? <laughs> or we're Make a knowledge religion check. Knowledge religion. That's going to be a problem. Okay. Okay, there it Ten. He's wearing a... Do you wear a holy symbol? Uh, Is there a holy I wear, symbol? I wear a silver chain with some ornate wow. decor upon it. Uh, inlaid into the metal. He could be a cleric. Um, he could be a wizard. He could be a really fancy guy. I, I have a question. This, yeah. this is out, out of character. Tell her what this I chain, am. since you are a patron, uh, or what, it what was it that you said? Your, your my daddy issues. <laughs> yeah. So, so is this the chain? chain? The more time I can spend towards my faith. <laughs> okay, whatever floats your boat. I'm really leaving. <laughs> <laughs> um. So, with we're currently paying because you will need to bring back proof of each rat you kill. It is going to be <coughs> a copper per rat. Bring back the and all you have to do is bring back the tails. The bodies you can do with as you please. I know some people tend to eat them. Yeah, if you're hungry. That's not a problem. I eat rats all the time, especially with corn. Don't get much corn. <laughs> Lesnia doesn't like to give up the corn. So, yeah, you bring back the tails from each one. Okay. We'll give you a copper piece each. Does that seem fair to you, or do you think? Fair enough. See how many we can get. Maybe I mean, it's rats. Like, I don't know if you're going to get much more than gold, I but I can't help it. Did I start with any money at all, or do I start as a bum? When you're looking for work? <laughs> Alright. If we're all in agreement. I can... Might as well get this job over and done with. Please work. What about you? You're gonna come down with us, or are you busy up here? Well, all my bite uh, victims for today have been treated. 
I see no reason why I shouldn't be on site to assist with two potentially more. Make a perception if, check. All three of you. Um, I'd like to say if the group hasn't returned from before. Six. 18 plus. Bu- 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 bu, where's perception? Uh, if the other group hasn't two, returned, 20. then they must probably need medical attention. You hear a crash. Somebody yelling. Hmm. Sounds like my services might need be needed up here after all. You go investigate? I will go investigate. I'll go with them. I'll, I'll go as well. I'll you see, I follow. All right. You actually heard this because you were walking over. You see this crate bro- literally broken open at the top, kind of leaning to one side, and this guy, poor guy, with his hand trapped under the crate between it and the next crate. And you see blood just running out of his hand, and he is very white. Like, you can tell he's losing blood, and he's screaming. All right. <laughs> Help! Did that hurt? Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm going to run right towards him. Um, actually, so... Would my perception check count towards just the sound or what's... Oh, yeah, it's quite clear. Okay, so it's quite clear. It's just two boxes, came forward, pinched his hand. Yeah. Okay, so I'm I'm definitely going to run right up to him to move, uh, try and push one of the boxes off his hand, or at least get enough leverage for him to pull his arm out. Make a strength check. You will have advantage because there's like five other people helping lift this crate off. All right. So another 18, and we're going to use that 18 plus my <laughs> two, so another 20. Oh, yeah. E- they easily move it off, and this guy immediately grabs his hand and passes the fuck out. All right. Then I guess we're on to using my medicine yep. skill. Which I do have proficiency in. Right back. This one's been rolling hot. One. Nine plus four, 13. Easily enough. Easily bandaged up. And he, they take him off. You staunch to the bleeding. He's fine. <coughs> All right. And they carry him off to put him into your tent to let him wake up whenever he wakes up. Perfect. All right. Well, now that that business is done. I have a question. Yes. 42. Do we want to wait towards the end of the day to see if the other group comes back? Do we want to go in to check on the other group? Or wait till the time that they come out, deal with them there, and then go in afterwards? The, f- the foreman is with us, correct? Yeah, he had went to see what the sound was about. What time were they due back, foreman? They literally just walked down there. No, oh, so we're just tailing behind the group that's We'd leaving now. We'd just be tailing behind the group. Yeah, the yeah, okay. they left like... Mm-hmm. So we'll be trying to catch up with them. Maybe 10, 15 minutes at most. Could see if they need any help. The more rats that they kill is the less gold you guys will receive. Hey, copper. don't say that. I need my gold. Copper. If he's saying, um, we need to go. We need to go to this place. I need my money. <laughs> right, let's go. Here we go. What happens in a crate? <laughs> Crates just did they, there. Did they the just leave him there and everybody took off? Oh, no, the guy's in the tent. No. No. Yeah, the guy who just went, put the uh, injured guy in, in the crate. What is in the crate? 
What's in the crate? Yes. Did it break open at all or? Oh yeah, you yeah. can see. Look in the crate. What's in it? Corn. <laughs> corn. <laughs> That's yeah. my answer. <laughs> There's whole ears of corn in there. I'm not interested in corn. Let's go for the gold <laughs> I mean rations, but no. I'm not saying that in front of him. <laughs> he works with him. <laughs> Mr. Cleric. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm going to head towards the uh, the gate area. No, okay. Follow as well. You follow see a guy on. standing down there looking at the gate. It's unlocked. It's open. You start walking through. And this is a gate that's like seven, eight feet. It's a big red. Or OUS is the The tunnel. And you I see know. this like iron grate. It's on it. He's, there's a padlock on the ground. I will do. No. All three of you check? make perception checks. I'm going somewhere. 17. Okay. 18 plus where's the perception? Oh, uh, 22. Not 10. That's a heavy duty dash. It, it, I will not roll it on this because it will dent it. What'd you get, Christina? 10. 10. 22 with uh, proficiency. Ben? Uh, I got uh, 17. With the proficiency. Ben, you've been in big cities before. Demir live in the sewers. Huh? <laughs> Demir live in the sewers. <laughs> yes, you know, sewers are usually nasty, smelly, not exactly the cleanest place. The water that seems to be running out of here, not very much of it, but kind of like it. It's relatively clean. It's like crystal clear water. I already don't like this place. I know what I need. It's called recycled sewer water. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it's sewer water. It's just a pool, though. Yeah, it's like there's nothing wrong with this water. Like you can smell how clean it is. You know, you should really dump your crap. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they live in it. Let me see the rest. Oh, thing. fertilizer. You have orange. Oh, yeah, the runoff and stuff would have went into that stuff. It's too clean. Especially for a farm. There would be like yeah. algae and stuff like that in there at least. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You can see that there's algae on the walls. Very little, but there is. There's a little bit of moss hanging all down. Eat it. Mm -hmm. for this all. Have to clear it, but... so... Or smoke it. <laughs> hmm. So I'm going to mentally toss with my trussum and uh, see if it notices any poison around. No. Okay. Uh, are you doing... <coughs> Since we don't have characters at the moment, or figures, okay. I, uh, which is something we are currently working on, don't worry about it. There you go. Unless you want a D4. Here, here's that one. Yeah, D4s. Yeah. Christina, there you go. what do you want from me? You said you were going to the stagecoach. You weren't dealing with no. us anymore. <laughs> he was He was at the docks. He I was, was at where the they sand. were, and then they all left. Yeah, you said you were, weren't going with them. No. All no. right. <laughs> so at the moment, we have, because we don't have figures, we have Ben, Christina, and Tim. This is the sewer they just entered. I don't know why my phone is doing this. There we go. So I guess I'll have to be nocturnal. Will you? No, I'll give it. All this. No. Too late. There we go. I'm going to move that. So I can move that. 
Alright, you guys are coming through. Shit. Um, I thought it was crystal clear water. Yeah, I dropped these. It is crystal clear water. It is dark in here. Well, he said that we were coming through shit. So. Or. <laughs> About 60 feet, it's still light. So you will be able to see. Half elf has dark vision. And I have dark vision as a dwarf. Okay. I can see through the eyes of my trust and who has dark vision. <laughs> <laughs> They're fucking enough. We're all sorties. Yeah, I would be no use there. <laughs> Sorry, come in front of the camera. Like yeah. Oh. Damn it! I love the fact that if I can see through the eyes of my Tressum in dark vision, yeah, and they I see invisible, anyway. they see invisible objects. I could just have the eyes of the Tressum look through down the arrows. Depends. Okay. Depends on the DM. Yeah, I would be useless right there. The Not necessarily. Depends on the DM. All right. So I can only do what I have here. Um, I actually like that idea a lot. Isn't it cool? Yeah. And you have another seat right over there. Yep. I'm going to be moving around over here. You're fine. I almost brought a character, but I, I did forget to pick him up. I'm going to be painting mine right. when it comes in. So. so do you keep moving down the hallway? Uh, um, you aren't seeing anything but this little mm. bitty stream of water. Then, so I uh, think I'm up front. You're in the back because you're a cleric, right? Cleric ish. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Whatever. Right, so I'll be up the front as well. Okay. So, so we're going to have like this. I, it is about eight, ten feet wide. So it's mm. not overly cramped. Okay, Y'all can see. I can't. So, no reason for me to be there. So you keep moving forward? Yeah, uh, I mean, if there, if we did our perceptions, right so there's nothing, no yeah. alcoves off to the you side. You aren't seeing anything other than this tube. Then like, yeah, I mean, water running down. Walk down, down, walk down the tube. Well down. Okay, okay. <laughs> We're gonna move this down. You guys come to it. You can see it goes off this way, and it goes off this way. You get lost in the catacombs. Uh, no signs of rats or anything like that? No signs of the people? No, still nothing. Of us? Nothing. Any, any sounds that we would hear? <coughs> Make a perception <laughs> check. All of us? Wait, okay, we need another. Uh, eight. <laughs> no. Nineteen. Twenty plus two is twenty-two. Did you roll that twenty? I rolled that twenty. Fucking act. <laughs> 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 Nineteen. Just the sound of running water. I can't move any further, JT. And up this way, it seems to be. A little bit more muffled. And this way is right. almost, it's almost frozen. bone dry. I can't hear anything. So one way is bone dry it's and the other way is muffled. Which is not right if that sewer is going all the way through the town. The other thing is, if we were just behind the other people, we would be hearing them. Yeah. If they were having problems, we'd be hearing them. If there was an aftermath, we'd probably be hearing the rats. Also, if there's not enough water over here, is something blocking the water? No, there's more water on the way out. So yeah, that this is water. Because that must be almost constant. But that that's still, but this but that is almost wrong dry. dry. So there's no water flowing from there. Either something's blocking okay. it, or there's just no water. 
which is not right, especially if one side's going very strong and well, the other side's not. If they're coming in from that part of the town, then there's a possibility that there's just no drainage coming from that direction and that there would be a lip that would drop down into the actual like river and we're just seeing like right above where that lip is. So there's nothing coming from that direction. Go first, man. Okay. Can't, can the water's like this deep. Can we, can we push like a few inches? Can and then we cut the very bottom of the round. Do we want to approach the intersection just to see if there's just anything around down. that corner? Yeah, just to look down. Well, yeah, I'll approach it. I will go stealth. Okay. It's still a Thirteen. You got a sixty foot? Yes. With the trust. This continues on sixty foot into darkness. And nothing okay. <coughs> nothing else that we perceive in there? Or do we want to roll for that? I don't see anything else. How about down here now that we've approached just the water? Just maybe a little bit of hiney moss. The occasional crack in the wall. Some roots dangling through. Either we continue following the water or do we go down where it's dry to figure out why it's dry? How about splitting up? <laughs> no. We're by ourselves as only three of us. We're already unbeknownst split up, so. <laughs> True. <laughs> we decided to stay behind and not just to. Uh, <laughs> he did say he's, he hasn't played this in forever in a day and he's still trying to get a hang on it, so not that since, big of a deal. Since Oregon. Yeah. Man. Well, it's more along the lines I don't know exists. <laughs> so we can get we can get a torch. Something. Yeah. Torch we draw attention to us coming. Um, Best Hold on. We all have. Right. Oh, that's gonna work. Uh, ah, shit. <clears throat> um, that one you can turn it. It turns. Oh shit. Yeah, but it's still not sh short enough. Yeah, or tall enough. That's all right. Yep. Okay. It's not. It's not Open really it. that big. Use the real, big, real big of a deal. Channel it. Right. I'll just set it up there till we get to something more important. Yeah. Um, so we either hang left, or go straight. Can you use an artificial light rather than flame? If someone had a spell. Or like press digitation or something, or like make a <coughs> intelligence check. Don't you have some torches in your sixteen engineer? Just intelligence. Yep. Yep. Sixteen. You got a twelve plus four. The amount of travel you have. This could easily lead to. Whatever building that is, what is it's it? in the right direction. What building is it? There's a fort that we passed by. Thirty-three twisted. Oh, that's the. Oh. It can easily lead to that. Since oh. I've been here a week, would I know roughly the location? Oh yeah. Uh, so, twisted tower. Uh, okay. I mean, this has been following the direction of the main road. In town. That's true. Alright. Which means that he hasn't crapped for 40 years. <laughs> so, um. Okay. I, I will turn to you because you seem extremely new. Yeah. Stop barging. That's literally the first time in this town. Yeah, Do you know the, the that building above or someone from that weird tower? 
I can't say I've ever met him. Well, when I was walking down here, he seemed to be a little bit farther out of town, and uh, when, it is a fort of almost like fortress. When I talked to Walls, the, the these the are general store guy, I can't climb uh, the clerk. You can climb the outside of it if you want. Um, there's a way in. He mentioned there's, always a way. there's like a, a, a guy that made these sewers like forty years ago, and athletics talking about. Uh, him being outside athletics. Town. If this um, or acrobatics, if this is right, and, and yeah, athletics or the acrobatics that I've been showing, depending on whether you want to actually climb over, it, his pathway to his or do some funky or, way of trying to get up the wall hmm, with acrobatics. It would be odd <laughs> to spend really parkour up so much time, time building sewers in a small town. Only to not use them. <laughs> it is, but this seems like it's still going to town. And this, this is smooth like, work stone, like, this, and fit together. Wait, this just goes up to his place. To I don't know why he would need one this big. You can try again. Now, is is that one, like, the size of, like, yeah, they're the, all the, the same person size. door size? size? But that's better. So if that's going to his 20. area, then why does he need such a big height? True. It doesn't three. seem right for one person's house to have one the same size. As the rest you don't know it's a, that it's a one of her residence. Well, it is, a, it is a tower. It is a fortified tower. Like, so there's a wall have, around it. Did I get a good look of it as I was passing by to go to this job? Yeah. So it is a large strong stronghold, or is it like a decent sized building with fortification? It is pretty decent sized, and it has a wall around it. So not a house, more like a large. And, and, and I just climbed it. Yep, you're obviously, obviously at the meant top for of the wall. multiple people, right? um, but not used. But it seems I odd don't. that. As the general store clerk said, he has his don't bother me sign out there. <coughs> and so I don't really I didn't really get a chance to talk to most of the other locals, but they uh, Okay. You were standing all at I've the top known of the him wall. As a recluse. I have not once laid eyes looking on Looking at a entirely. helix shaped twisted tower. It was kind of Leaning. Tower of Hexagons. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be fun. So that's all I see. You're, yeah, you're standing at the top of this tower. Nobody around? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> you, you didn't know this because, well, you weren't paying attention when you came into town. This is a, not a person's residence. This is a army garrison. Hmm. Nice. And at each one of the top of these round areas up here is a hippogriff sitting there, looking around. Yes. Fortunately, you climbed up the tower. Higher low. Hmm? Higher low. I don't know what's inside. Well, you see a bunch of soldiers and hippogriffs. Yeah, I'd rather be outside. Okay. You... Make an athletics check. Two. So plus athletics. Two oh. plus your athletics. <laughs> Do a backflip. Do a flip. <laughs> Isn't there a bale of hay at the ground somewhere I can jump into? <laughs> <laughs> He messes it. 
You take four points damage from falling damn near 20 feet. Oh, where'd you put that at? Here, <laughs> <shit. laughs> <laughs> Uh, right here is your hit points. God, is right there, eleven. Eleven. Just <laughs> subtract. Keep that, but mark out four from that. <laughs> no, thank you. I just spun my die and it went for one. I really am sorry that this keeps happening. But that could also be. But we don't know that it's. We yeah. don't know it's him. We don't know. You what's guys going on. don't. We, we know. just we just, just hear there's this. could be. I mean, it's w- would lead right under there if it Rick. went that far. Rick. Um, also, the fact that the the guy from the um, the general market said that lots of things attack throughout the years at certain times, stuff like that. It could literally be they're just seeing something and going and taking care of it and coming back. So. Yeah, I don't know. I don't it, could also, uh-huh. it could also be something from the sewers breaking in. You don't know. <laughs> don't know. Because we didn't hear anything breaking through anything. We just down. suddenly heard the ringing. We just noise. suddenly yeah. heard the ringing. Yep. Yeah. So we assume okay, it's from the fortress. Then why would the fortress, why would the fortress with the garrison alarm have alarms going off? But you don't no. know it's a fortress. You guys don't know that there's a garrison there. We just know this is just. He knows there's a tower True. up there. Yeah, you all seen that tower when you're coming through. But it's now kind of hard to miss. But now suddenly there's ringing coming from this tower. Would Since I've been here for a week, would I know? You would. You've dealt with some of the soldiers. Cuts, bites from a fucking hippogriff. <laughs> Scratch marks from a hippogriff. Dealing with One the- guy had an interesting horseshoe print on his face. So the standard stuff. Yeah, 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 pretty much. <laughs> standard stuff, standard. <laughs> so I would know that's roughly coming from the fortress. It's a logical conclusion. Do we want to go check out this tower thing, or do we want to head I might as well go check it out. Might as well go check up the way of the fortress. There's now It's dry. On Ted. On. And he's dealt with soldiers. Oop. But... If there's soldiers up there, why is that red dry? Right. Because right. people be using it. And now it we're bringing it, so foot. we might as well go check it out and see what the hell's going yeah, on. Yeah, the, the fact that this isn't really running because of one person is not quite as odd, but now that there's that it, it, a lot more than one person, there, it's, then this should it's, be... It should be running as fast as the other side is. Yeah, or... Yeah, so we need to go check it out. Yeah. So, soldiers got a shit, too. <laughs> 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 I'd, be more worried, I'd be more worried about the hippogriffs. Yeah. Okay. For ease of convenience, you do see this goes on 60 feet. Mm-hmm. Goes on another 60 feet, then it dead ends here. When you get here, it dead ends. There's a grate underneath. Oh, great. Up there. Because you get to here, and you can tell... When you're coming this way, the smell of feces. And, the and you get noise. here and there's just a pile of it. And you see a very small, brown, icky stream that actually evaporates. And that's why it's been dry. Hungry? Okay. But there's a pile of shit. <laughs> okay, so it's just their shit pile that they haven't... That we haven't had the out. rainstorm to wash it out. I see. But do we hear, do we hear that alarm a lot more? Yeah, you hear it. now the alarm is actually... At least I smell something different than the door. <laughs> <laughs> it's my usual Tuesday. Yeah, you guys can't go any further because of the pile of mountain. Of it. <laughs> yeah. You claim it. I think it's safe to turn back. I think and it's reasonably happened. enough, there's no rat sound. With the rat no problem, rat. there would be rats all over that plane. That's free, that's free that's real estate. Yes. <laughs> yeah. There's occasionally some flies, but that's not it. it that's so where am I take note? Oh. Ready to head back? I think yes. Sorry. Let's continue. Sorry, I gotta do this in character. Are you ready to head back? <laughs> yeah, you're over here. Laying yes, on the ground I think going, that oh, would be prudent. Fuck. <laughs> 
Against Renan. Okay, what do you do? <laughs> Get up and run. You don't see... None of the guards are coming after you. No. Okay. Maybe I climb again. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you climb the wall again? I don't know if I want a chance at it again. <laughs> Now, you do I'm see that the grass around here, because there is grass around here, is very neatly trimmed. Like, somebody mows it? Cuts it? You're not sure. I want to wait and see what the alarm is. <laughs> Freshly manicured lawn. With a big face <laughs> in it. They even articulated or where they're the going or what face. they're doing. <laughs> you see five to eight hippogriffs take off in a direction. Now, do you do you know what a hippogriff is? Okay, you've seen Harry Potter. That's a hippogriff. Yeah, they're all heading out in this one direction. All of them. Like, there, you notice eight of them all take off. Is there any left? You can't tell because the wall's up there. <laughs> but you did notice that the two that were on the ends here, right here and here, took off. So there's obviously not hippogriffs on these four, two corners anymore. Is there a way in from the bottom? Going through the main entrance? Yeah. You can do that. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. You start walking around? Mm -hmm. Okay. What are you guys doing? Heading back, heading back to the fork and we're going to head down the other way. We're going maze style. Take a left. Take a left. Take a left. Take a left. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, y'all are snooping underground. I'm snooping above ground. <laughs> You're doing the Welcome to the friends. underground. How I mean, a rogue <laughs> searching in the daylight while <laughs> the fighter, okay. the, He's level one. the cleric, <laughs> and the okay. other rogues. <laughs> You guys go 120 feet straight down the tunnel. Nothing has fucking changed. And you come across another entrance, or er, T-shape. That seems to go off. We're gonna have to leave soon. Okay. So you can actually see the end of this one. The roads are going to start <laughs> icing up. It's going to be a pain 60 in the feet down there. Yeah. Oh. The small, April. tiny buildings. It could be. But there is that other building off to the side. <laughs> um. Well. I don't think that we're quite close, or quite at the town or anything like that. You make it to the front of, front entrance. You see a guard standing on either side of the portcullis. They have a halberd in your hand. Armored. I'll go back to where I was. <laughs> can I help you? Can As you turn around and start to walk off. See in dim light as if it was bright light. Okay. If it was well, pure darkness, we can see as if it was dim light. We can't discern color and darkness from the nope. shades of gray, okay. so we would be able to see fully what's down there, um, even in darkness. Is it dead end? Yeah, it, d but shadow still gets darker. No, I'm saying, yeah, you, but no, can't it, you see anything in because dark vision we can see in darkness. Yeah, but there's no light. You can see a dim light. Though. Yeah, I know. We can still, it's, it's, we can still, it's still dark. Yeah, so you don't. See anything down there? So, if we, I would like to go down there. If there's another grate, I kind of want to know what, what. See if we can hear anything that's up above the grate. Things like that. What this building yeah. is, hey. because 
Put it back for a second. There we go. Um. You could go down and see if there is a grate there. I guess. Well, it, I guess it, there should be if there's an end. But it said it's super dark down there. Mm-hmm. We would be able to see if there was light at the end of that. Yeah, there's no light. It's just dark. So there's no point really going down there. Well, isn't darkness just pure? Yeah, it's pure dark. Black. So we would be able to see as if it was dim light. So dim light's what thirty feet. Yeah, something like that. Correct. Yeah, but he. So they, we would, we would they have need, dark vision. Yeah, and we would only need to go down halfway yeah. in dim light just to see everything. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You make a perception check when you get down to right before the end. One. You weren't there. Shut up. 23. Seven. 19 uh, nine. plus uh, nine. four. 23. What was it? Nine. Nine? Twenty-three. Twenty-three? Twenty-three. You recognize the song that you hear coming from the grate, once again, and a pile of shit. So the shit's causing darkness. The shit's causing the music. No. But you recognize this hymn being played. You've been here before. This is Morning Dawn Hall. You're, you're hearing it's the music sh- playing and all of a sudden... Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> It, it, you know it's kind of muffled, but if this is the restroom, basically, <coughs> that means Morning Dawn Hall Chapel is, like, over there. So that would make sense for the reason it's muffled. Because it would be traveling down through the pile of poo. Yeah. You're going to dig to the pile for treasure? No, no. <laughs> no that's, that's, where, that's in the poo on the lawn because that's the dog. Again, we just see the pile of poo. There's still no rats. Or and a pile of poo in the song. That's... You guys look sound like you're lost in the sewers. <laughs> We're looking for rats. I want my money. Yeah, and they have a curiosity. And I haven't found a single rat yet. I'm just looking not for a an easy score. <laughs> not a single, not a single rat. Not going? a single. Yeah. Lick of the, the first. Oh, I'm gonna say lick down here, please. I'm gonna check climbing again. <laughs> Make a um athletics check. Um, uh, that's a D two. Nah, you need a D twenty. There you go. Much better. Nineteen. You're standing at the top. There's no hippogriffs on this side. You see the two over here on these far corners. What about no. anybody inside? Oh, angry boy. You see still a bunch of soldiers here. inside. They're yes. seeming to calm down from the alarm. And you see two guys leading another pair of hippogriffs up the ramps. They come up to these corners. Is there any rooms or doors or anything else? Not up here. It's a wall. Anything above? The tower. That's over there. <coughs> no way across. Nope. There's you. Ground. Tower. There's nothing up here. It's a garrison. If I can't make the jump, you're gonna have to toss me. Don't, don't tell the elf. <laughs> hey! Who are you? Why are you up there? 